In the mid-1930s, the world was witnessing rapid advancements in aviation technology. Germany in particular was rearming and developing its air force, the Luftwaffe, at an alarming pace, which was a major concern for the British. The British Royal Air Force, RAF, recognized that their current biplane fighters, while having served effectively in World War I, were no match for the new generation of faster, more heavily armed monoplane fighters being developed by potential adversaries. There was a clear and pressing need for a modern, high-performance fighter aircraft. Designed by Hawker Aircraft Limited in the mid-1930s, the Hurricane was the first British monoplane fighter and the first capable of exceeding a top speed of 300 miles per hour. The chief designer, Sir Sidney Cam, intended the aircraft to be simple, robust, and easy to produce quickly. The Hurricane was powered by the famed Rolls-Royce Merlin engine, a liquid-cooled V-12 beast that could deliver around 1,030 horsepower. The Hurricane's design was pragmatic using traditional construction methods which enabled rapid production and easy field repairs. Its fuselage incorporated a tubular metal airframe covered largely by fabric, with a metal-clad forward section and wings. The aircraft was known for its speed and maneuverability. It could reach a maximum speed of around 340 miles per hour at 22,000 feet, with a service ceiling of about 36,000 feet. The Hurricane could reach 20,000 feet in just over nine minutes, a significant advantage in combat scenarios. The armament of the Hurricane was formidable for its time. Initially, it was outfitted with eight 303 Browning machine guns mounted in the wings. This firepower combined with its performance made the Hurricane a deadly opponent. Later versions of the Hurricane would also be equipped with 20 mm cannons, and some variants could carry bombs or rockets for ground attack missions. There were numerous variants of the Hurricane throughout the war. One of the most notable was the Hurricane Mark II, which introduced the more powerful Merlin 20 engine and various armament configurations, including versions specialized for ground attack that carried two 40mm cannons. The Sea Hurricane, adapted for operation from aircraft carriers, also played a pivotal role in protecting convoys from enemy aircraft. The Hurricane saw extensive service throughout World War II, perhaps most famously during the Battle of Britain in 1940, Despite being overshadowed in the public eye by the Supermarine Spitfire, it was the Hurricane that was the workhorse of the RAF during this crucial conflict, accounting for the majority of the RAF's air victories. Hurricanes served in all the major theatres of war, operated by several nations, and were known for their resilience and dependability. The Hawker Hurricane was a versatile, reliable and highly effective aircraft, and its contributions were instrumental in the Allied victory in World War II.